Attending a Super Bowl is a once in a lifetime experience for most people, but for a special group known as the Never Miss a Super Bowl Club, it's an annual tradition. I spoke with one of those club members this week who says the sky high ticket prices for this year's big game almost ended the streak. I'm a member of the Never Miss a Super Bowl Club. This is Don Chrisman. He is one of the Never Miss a Super Bowl Club's founding members. He has been to all 57 Super Bowls, but making 58 has been in jeopardy. I run into people who just want to go to one and I kind of feel selfish, <laughs> but I can't get it out of my system. Through nearly six decades, the club grew to six members, but now there's only three left. The remaining three are in their 80s, and Chrisman says he feels blessed to have another chance to go to the big game with the guys. We're getting near the end of the road, so this could be the final reunion, and I'm looking forward to it. With the average price for one ticket being around $9,500 on Ticketmaster, the decades-long streak for this group's annual reunion was put in jeopardy. So Verizon stepped in. How about two tickets to the Super Bowl? Oh my God. Are you kidding me? No. With the two free tickets to the game, Chrisman has become an honorary member of the Verizon Test Force, which is a group of thousands of engineers for the company, a field he's very familiar with. I started out as a production technician and a junior engineer. Chrisman says he's thankful for this opportunity, but says at his age, it's about much more than just a chance and watching another Super Bowl. I think, you know, in the beginning, the game had a higher level of importance, but now I think it's more important to get together with the guys. Reporting in Las Vegas, I'm Ryan Ketchum.